Hey folks, and welcome to my round one battle in Purple Kazooie's uh, monocolor tournament. Uh, my first round opponent is um, Purple Pick Me winner. Uh, there should be a link to his channel. Um, and I chose green for my color. He chose yellow for his. Um, and who better to lead a green team than Al Gore? Um, Starting off my team, I have El Kabong, who you've seen before, um, who manages to uh, put his lead Blaziken to sleep. I was very grateful that um, his Blaziken wasn't faster, and so now um, I'm able to set up with Toxic Spikes. Um, since I've got the Sash, I should be able to set up two rounds of Toxic Spikes unless he uses Taunt, which he doesn't. Um, and I was also very grateful that uh, El Kabong was faster than his Electivire as well. Electivire uses Ice Beam, uh, which I expected to one-hit KO, but it only does about half, um, so that's great. Um, I'm going to be able to pull back uh, El Kabong and save uh, him for later. Um, save your energy, haha. <laughs> yeah, there's a bunch of energy puns in here. Uh, anyway, I switch out to um, Tyranitar. Uh, who whips up a sandstorm. Uh, Electivire uses Ice Beam, um, which does absolutely nothing to Quants. Yeah, uh, that's a reference to Dinosaur Comics. Um, I mean, T-Rex, that was just a lame name, um, but that is who it's named after. Um, so Quants um, is going to do some further setting up with uh, a round of Stealth Rock. Um, and I'm feeling pretty good right now because um, the Sandstorm boosts uh, his special defense. Um, anyway, he goes with Focus Blast, so I was not expecting that. And even at 4x effective, it does not take out um, it does not take out my T-Tar, which you know just says something about how much of a beast it is. Also, I don't think my opponent EV trained, um, so that could bar partially be it. So I'm expecting another similar attack. Um, and I switch in uh, Onion, my uh, Ludicolo, uh, and that's a reference to Onion Gravy's um, mono uh, Ludicolo team, which never ceases to amuse me. Um, so anyway, uh, he uses Earthquake, which I guess I was surprised that he's, um, I guess it's a special, it's a mixed set. Uh, earthquake, um, and then three special attacks. I guess I've seen all of his attacks now. Um, so I go ahead and use Surf, not expecting it to take out Electivire, but it does. So that's pretty cool. Um, Ludicolo is kind of a beast. Um, and I guess uh, Onion um, picked a good Pokemon to make a mono team out of because you can also do a lot of things with um, Ludicolo. Um, anyway, he sends out Jirachi, um, and I don't really think there's too much I can do against Jirachi, so I'm going to um, pull back Ludicolo. Um, so even though I've taken out one of his guys and put one of them to sleep, I'm doing a lot of switching, and a lot of my guys are kind of crippled, so I'm not feeling too good right now. Um, yeah, was not expecting Aerial Ace on a Jirachi, um, but it's a good thing I did that switch. Um, so my Flygon uh, takes it well, uh, and I go ahead and use Earthquake. Um, he, of course, predicts the switch and switches in Latias. Um, Latias is uber, but I guess it's allowed for this tournament, so eh, whatever, not a big deal. Um, anyway, Earthquake uh, misses, and now um, I'm going to have to pull out um, Flygon. I'm expecting... Um, a Dragon Pulse here. So I go ahead and switch into Celebi. Um, what I wasn't expecting was Ice Beam, um, which is going to be a super effective hit, but uh, Celebi takes the hit quite well, uh, ends up with about half HP, um, and Leftover's recovery will restore the damage done by Sandstorm. Um, yeah, there you go. Uh, so Celebi really can't do too much against... Uh, against him, so I go ahead and use U-Turn. Um, I mean, that's what I was planning on doing the whole time. What I wasn't expecting was that Celebi would be faster, faster. although I could have figured that out from the Sandstorm, um, who, da who got damaged first priority. So I go ahead and switch to Onion, um, just to fodder, uh, just for death fodder. Um, my other guys would be far more useful, I figure. Um, I was really stupid here, and I didn't write down... Um, all of his Pokemon, uh, and so I really had no idea who was still left and who I should be expecting. Um, so I go ahead and switch to Onion, who's going to take it out with a, a, another U-turn, um, and down goes Latias, so uh, that's nice. Um, again, that's, I re really didn't mind that he was using that Uber, because it's a fairly new development that Latias even is Uber. Um, 
so it's really not that big of a deal. Uh, and, you know, the match didn't exactly depend on it. So I go ahead and switch into Serenity, my new Yan Mega. Um, Serenity is the son of Mal. Um, you can figure out a naming theme there. Um, uh, basically, I, I bred this one from um, my uh, older uh, Yan Mega, who you've seen on other teams. Um, and anyway, I pull back Yan Mega because it really can't do much today uh, and switch back into um, Kimiko, my... Um, Flygon. So the the name behind Kimiko is a reference to um, Kimiko Ross of uh, the comic Dresden Kodak. Yeah, a lot of these guys are webcomic or other geekiness um, inspired. And so anyway, an earthquake takes out Raikou in one hit, uh, which is very nice. I was really hoping that Raikou didn't Raikou didn't run Ice Beam, and I was glad to see that he didn't. So now he sends out Jirachi, and I'm just going to keep on using Earthquake. Um, so his color is yellow, and he's got a lot of electric types, which is pretty much, I think, what cost him the match. Oop, spoiler. Um, at this point, I mean, you know, I'm, I've got a pretty good sweep going. Um, and so he sends out Jolteon, which is kind of the best he can do. Um, and those Toxic Spikes uh, aren't haven't really helped me too much thus far. Um, Kimiko uses Earthquake, um, and he's got a Shuka Berry, uh, which is going to half its damage. Um, so Jolteon is going to survive the hit with just a little bit of HP. Um, I have no idea why he used Thunder. I'm guessing that was either a misclick or he had no other choice. Um, so Sandstorm does uh, quite a bit of damage, and then the rest of the damage is done by Poison. So those Toxic Spikes were very nice for me. Uh, were, were very nice, and I'm very glad I set them up. Um, yeah, I'm still. I still don't really have a good feel for this team. It's not necessarily the best planned team I ever have. So his last Pokemon is Blaziken, and I know I can outrun it. So Earthquake is going to one hit KO it, even if it had a Focus Sash. The Sash is broken by Sandstorm, so um, that takes out Blaziken, and I've won the match, um, which is great. So I'll be advancing to round two. Um, anyway, I hope you enjoyed that, and if you're competing in the tournament. I hope to see you. Uh, other people, everyone, comment, rate, subscribe, and challenge. Uh, and sign up for my tournament.